The lock tool allows you to select parts which make them unselectable with your mouse. While unlock all simply unlocks all. The anchor toggle should be turned on in most cases. You can use Alter to toggle it to parts selected. The anchor tool makes it so parts and objects are not affected by gravity or physics in a playtest. Let's perform an experiment here. We e e e Well that was so fun, anyway. Let's move on to solid geometry, I'll mainly be discussing union and negate. As they are most commonly used. Using negate is like a cutting tool. You must select a part and then toggle it into a negatable selection and then you must select other parts. A good way of thinking of this is with a body part and tool part. The tool part affects the body part, in this case the negation is the tool part. When selected all parts you press union. Using union on its own is just joining parts together to create a single part. Typically you will need to activate use part color in properties to change the color of a union. Unions will not behave like models, they will stretch and not be scaled uniformly. 